Hello everyone, Logan from Curated Avalon, and today I'm continuing with the Red Listed Noodlers inks with Apache Sunset. I thought this would be quite appropriate for Halloween. Happy Halloween, everyone. This one has been renamed from Apache Sunset to Southwest Sunset. And this is kind of a legend among Noodlers inks, but I myself have not tried it before, so I'm very much looking forward to seeing just how brilliantly orange this ink is. I'm going to try to give it a good shake up. Difficult when Noodlers ink bottles are new because they are filled completely to the top. So you want to be careful when you're opening them. I have a couple of different papers to try and I'll be using my Sailor Pro Gear Stellar Black Hole Pen. I call this my Captain Kirk pen. This has a zoom nib, so it should show the ink up really nicely. Should be able to get some variation from a thin to a fatter line. That is so incredibly full. That might be the fullest one I've ever seen. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to clean the nib off real quick with a paper towel. Just wipe a little excess off. And I'm going to swab. I want that to go ahead and dry, so I'll cap this. Very carefully open this back up. Wow, that is a very brilliant orange. It does go to yellow. So Sunset is a very appropriate name. Okay, so I think that is pretty fantastic color-wise. Love the variation. It's still drying on the swab. That is so pretty. I'm gonna set that aside and let it dry, and I'm going to try it on the onion skin paper. I hadn't actually intended to use this notepad for ink tests, but it was a request, so I thought, why not? See how well the onion skin paper holds up to a swab.
and of course this is now called Southwest Sunset. That looks pretty fantastic on this paper, too. And that is side by side. So we have Tomoe River paper here, and then the onion skin paper here. Onion skin paper is thin, very much like the Tomori River. I think this is a little thicker overall. Uh, it didn't bleed through, so that's good. I'm not really seeing maybe, maybe a little bit of bleed through if you want to be picky. It's drying at about the same speed. It dries very quickly when written down. Swabs are taking a little bit longer. I think the color overall shows up much more nicely on the Tomoe River paper. But it wouldn't be enough of a difference for me to not use the onion skin because I think it also looks quite nice. Very cool. This is an absolutely Gorgeous ink. I think I would definitely like to keep this in my immediate collection. Thank you so much for watching. Everyone have a safe and happy Halloween.